now Take a step outside and seize the day now Set aside your worries Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I worked all day long and I'm kind of looking for a quick and easy dinner this evening. So I'm gonna show you guys a little recipe that I whipped up and just grabbed some ingredients on my way home. But before we get started, I wanted to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by Elec Homes and I've actually worked with them before. I have one of their professional grade high power blenders. It works amazing. I've used it for quite some time now and it's definitely very good quality, especially for the price. I mean, you can't beat the price of their kitchen appliances and for the quality, they are awesome. So I'm so excited to work with them again and bring you another kitchen appliance. They just released their pressure cooker and I love pressure cookers. They are so convenient and so quick, especially when you've been gone all day and you didn't put something on slow cook. You can whip it up really quickly with these, and this one has a ton of great features. There's so much you can do with this pressure cooker, anything from making yogurt to cakes. You can hard boil eggs, cook rice, make soup, and one of our absolute favorites is we like to use it to make our ribs. This pressure cooker comes with so many different accessories and anything and everything that you'll need. I love the fact that it has a time setting on it so whenever it's finished it goes right to warm so even if you're away you don't have to worry about anything burning. It also has a slow cooker setting so you can use it just like a slow cooker. Elec Holmes just released this pressure cooker so you guys are going to get in on a great sale. They have an early bird special that is 40% off so check the description box for that code. You're not going to want to miss out on it. It is for a limited time only, and I would highly recommend taking advantage of this deal. All right, so let's get cooking. The first thing you're gonna need is about three chicken breasts. I cut mine a little bit on the thinner side just so they were easier to cut up once I pulled them out of the pressure cooker. You're gonna need a block of softened cream cheese, a tablespoon of everything bagel seasoning, a handful of cilantro. I just chopped mine up. You actually wouldn't need to, but I just thought it would be a little easier to eat this way. Next, you'll need two tablespoons of spicy brown mustard, and then I just used a hand blender to blend everything up and get it to a nice creamy consistency. Next, you'll add about a cup of water to the bottom of the slow cooker with the chicken. Then I took my creamy mixture and just kind of dumped it in and smeared it all over the top of the chicken. Lastly, I took Romano cheese and liberally sprinkled it in over top of the chicken. I put it on the poultry setting for about 25 minutes and put the lid in place. Next, I heated up some rice cauliflower in the microwave to go along with the chicken. Another quick side that I like to do on busy days is deviled eggs. They're so simple and everybody in our household absolutely loves them. Once you've peeled your hard boiled eggs, you'll just take the yellow parts out and let the eggs cut in half on a plate. I mix in mayo, some Dijon mustard, and just kind of mash it all together and whip it up. I don't have exact measurements, so you can play with it to your taste. Then you refill the eggs with the mixture. Next, I sprinkled some chili lime seasoning over top of the eggs. It was so good this way. And it wasn't long and my chicken was done. It was so delicious, we dug in right away and I did not get a picture of my plate. All right guys, so here is a real life day. Sometimes I don't get my nighttime routine done and I end up crashing and falling asleep before all of this gets done. So I woke up to a dirty kitchen the next morning and just got to work doing what I would normally do with my nighttime routine. Um, something I do pretty often is I kind of mop the area that the girls sit at their little table just because it gets a lot of sticky stuff on it. Mm -hmm. 
Next, I grabbed the laundry and kind of got everything switched around. I try to fold about one load every night, but again, since I didn't do my regular routine the night before, I was doing a little bit of catch up and decided to go ahead and put the second load into the dryer and do two loads in the same day. My dishwasher was already empty, so I just went ahead and put all of the dishes from the night before into the dishwasher. This dishwasher, my friend even made a comment the other day, it cleans so fast and so efficiently. I don't know if it's just one of those old ones that will last forever and does an amazing job, but I have definitely been enjoying it since we moved. kitchen was done and actually this day we had some friends over so the kids were sitting on my bed watching a movie and I didn't want to bother them they were enjoying themselves so I decided to just go ahead and pick up the toys in the living room myself they ended up cleaning up the toys in their bedrooms later on in the day but because I wanted a fresh start to get my morning picked off right I just went ahead and picked everything up from the day before
You all know if you watch me often that this is pretty much my nighttime routine. If you're new around here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Also, don't forget to check out that great coupon code in the description box to get yourself a pressure cooker. And I will see you guys in my next vlog. Bye.